Okay. Uh, so attacking light as usual. Um, it looks like we're getting stomped on here, which I think is kind of funny because uh, we are in fact ranked pretty lowly here. So 160, which means we're probably gonna get knocked down to like 250, maybe lower, something like that. Um, so yeah, that kind of sucks. Um, I think we lost a few members too as well. Uh, I remember some people arguing in the uh, in this chat here, um, but I'm not entirely sure what what happened just because I really don't uh, know the skill that well. Uh, but yeah, so we're getting kind of stomped out here. We'll see how our defense did. Uh, let's see. Yep. So we just got stomped out. Uh, let's go back. Just kind of see what they got here. So I can attack this tower. That has Riolu, which is pretty irritating already. And this tower, of course, they have Riolu and they have him. Um. Hmm. So this is our leader right here, and he. He failed against both of these, which is kind of interesting. Uh, this guy has some pretty good stuff, so the fact that he beat them both is pretty cool. I can see that. Um, yeah, I mean, let's just kind of, I mean, we already kind of lost, so we're just kind of, we can attack whatever we want, especially, I mean, it says right here, no strats, attack whatever. Uh, I'm not too interested in just kind of running in there and bashing against something and dying immediately, so... Um, I think this one down here would benefit from, uh, where's Ruel? There we go. Uh, so she baits him and then she attacks these two. Uh, and then Ruel does Ruel things. Ruel's gonna bait her. Um, so yeah, hopefully, I mean, this turns out well. Hopefully, it comes down to like, you know, who's who's uh, S10 and he's geared, geared better. Uh, these other are, are kind of interesting, they're kind of valuable, but not entirely, not necessarily. Um, so I want him up here. Maybe like you and like Charles or something would be kind of interesting. Um, problematically she's going to um, taunt him, so maybe not. Uh, I should probably bring a healer. Um, let's go find a healer. That can deal with this. Um, probably just going to be uh, Montmorency. You know what, I guess maybe, yeah, I think I'm just going to go with uh, Crow, Montmorency, and uh, SSB. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm always paranoid about Alencia, but like, she's never really that big a threat, so I think we'll be fine. Let's just go in there. Um, now, obviously, I'm not going in kind of like, oh, let's just throw all these matches. It's not necessarily uh, the way I'm looking at it, it's, but it, to a large degree, it's kind of like, you know. For one, like I said, it's kind of late, and two... We're already gonna kind of lose anyway, so I'm not too stressed out about trying to win any of these in particular. Uh, and then, of course, as usual, I'm kind of a dense idiot, so I forgot about the uh, strip on the Alencia. Um, okay, that defense buff is, of course, going to be very, um, very potent. Let's see what kind of damage we're looking at from this, uh... From this villager. Uh, so unfortunately the villager did not get the, uh, unbuffable, but which is... doesn't really matter because we, uh... And he's dead. Um, which doesn't really matter too much just because... For one, he died, so... If he got the Alexas, it's going to be now. And then for two, um, he didn't get the Alexas anyway, so we're fine. Um, 
I wanna not, I wanna save this so I can do this here. Uh, maybe I should've just healed it off and then not worried about it cause... Um, well, let's just do it, it doesn't really matter. Uh, just because mainly like he's got the hit debuff so, the, the hit chance debuff so... Yeah, I was gonna miss and not do full damage which is fine cause they can't heal so it doesn't matter. Oof, oof, she's gonna die. Yeah, she's dead. Um, so there you go, that's kind of what happens when you're not careful. Uh, so that would have been avoided if I had just uh, Montmorency healed instead of been greedy with the S3 on the Crow, but um, I was greedy with the S3 on the Crow, so, you know. Uh, so yeah, I don't think we can win this anymore, um, which is fine. Uh, let's go see what... Uh, maybe I could draw, but I really don't feel like uh, wasting my time just because, like I said, it's not gonna be worth it. Like, the, like I'm gonna get a little bit more Mystic Medals from the draw than I would have um, from the not draw. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's, it's just not that big a deal. Um, I don't know how tanky this Ruel is, but let's just hit her with this, I guess. Okay, so I don't know what artifact artifact she's on. Um, of course, my first turn doesn't really matter too much here, so I think I'm just gonna do nothing. I'm just gonna S1 somebody. Just S1 you. Oh, she's got such a Rekos. Oh, I didn't see it the first time once when uh, Lilius S3s. Let's see if she can stun me. Oh man, that's a lot of damage. That is a uh, heavy hitting. Um, that's a heavy hitting. Uh, what's her name there? And of course, I get the uh, S1 team up from the wrong person, as always. Um, let's hit the wrong person again. So she's gonna hit herself, which is fine. Uh, that's a lot of damage. So his team up actually turned out fine. My team ups, that's two, that's already two uh, S1s from the, um, from her that have not landed on anything. They have not landed on the, the uh, Estenibria. So kind of the, the fortune we had last time, I think. Um, there she goes, okay. So I think what I was saying was like the, the luck we had last time, um, Kind of worn off a bit here. Um, okay. Of course, she hits the Tsunami again. Um, problematically, if she hits Ruel again, she's gonna die. Um, it's just that plain and simple. I don't think I'll be able to like out sustain. Or I'll outpace that. Um, yeah, I just have to burn the S3 on her. Or not burn the S3, but activate the S3 on her. And then wait a while and... and uh, I mean, either way, it's like she's doing so much damage to this to my Ruel that... Um, we can't really deal with what's going on here, so... And she's gonna revive. Uh, I need to not hit... The crow with this, and I hit the crow, of course. She's going to heal the crow, presumably, hopefully. Yeah, he's the lowest, so she's going to S3 the crow, which is good. Which is one of the reasons I kind of hesitate to put um, to have crow with Ruel, is because she only has like a she has really huge single target heals. In fact, uh, they're so big that one of them does, in fact, um, max heal, right? Um, and it kind of has an adverse effect on, on crowd depending on timing and, and you know speed tuning and such Okay, so let's save this Because um, I'm going to need that later Come on, please Please Oh, actually, yeah, so the S1 no longer cleaves because my S3 is now available. And, if, wow, so, so every single time that 
This Tenebria has used her S. Uh, uh, every time she's used her S1, she's hit both Ruel and uh, her at the same time. So, um, like I said before, it's just uh, the luck we had last time is kind of you know we're making up for it. Uh, so it's sort of the law of averages, I guess you could say for for any of you any of you out there familiar with that. Um, again, so we didn't bring uh, S10A, of course, because why would we? Uh, am I going to take, yeah, so I think she has Cal Adra, I'm not entirely sure. She does a lot of damage though, so. Um... Let's just do this, see what happens. And of course, because why would you? Thank you, finally. But I didn't get the crit, so that kind of sucks. Okay, so we get to heal ourselves. We we're gonna get to heal ourselves here. Um, I'm a little annoyed. Kind of annoyed, kind of calm. So there we go. We finally got to, to not to land on the um, on my what's her name here. Uh, let's just hit you with this, or hit you with this. Why not? Thank you. Okay. Uh, this isn't going to work. Um, let's just do it anyway. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, that's nowhere near enough damage. Um, and of course we didn't hit... There we go, the, the Tenebria. So she's gonna heal herself, which is alright. But yeah, this is actually getting on my nerves, how poorly this is turning out. Like, everything that can go wrong is going wrong here, so... Of course I'm getting a little pissed. I'm not getting that mad, um... Uh, our, whole team, our, whole, our whole team has been getting stomped out uh, this guild war, so I'm not like too upset by it. Um, especially just because like today I had like such a good day on on uh, in AR. Thank you. So we are close to killing Spectre Tenebria. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, and of course my S3 is up, so it's not going to do anything. And she healed her again, so we were so close to killing her, but uh, couldn't do it. Uh, now, unfortunately, oh, what's this? Yeah, so I'm only getting the S1 damage here. Let us... He's actually healed, so he's not gonna S3 yet. So I'm good to do this on her. I don't know how much resistance this Krau has. But I think I'm just gonna do this on him, uh, just because yeah, his S2 is up. So just to see if I can get him to not S2. Carsey resisted it. Okay. Yeah, well, good. Good news is we're finally not. Um, let's see. Uh, the good news is we're finally getting uh, S Spectre Tenebria's S1s to not hit my Tenebria. Come on, hit Tenebria. Please hit Tenebria. Thank you. Of course, I didn't get the Tenebria team up. This is fine uh it's better than having having the defense buff up i get some stacks well she gets some stacks too so that's kind of worrisome and i didn't actually die so that's pretty cool uh, let's heal you oh actually yeah, that's not what i wanted to do I, that's not what i should have done there is what i should say i mean this is what i wanted to do but it's not what i should have done because she has the biggest health bar right now 
I really should have burned the S3 on her so that like it would have the most effect. Uh, but I did not, so that's kind of a bummer. What's kind of cool about this now is that my uh, is she's gonna get to do this. Okay. Oh, please don't. Oh wow, it resisted. So that's pretty cool. Come on, come on, Tenebria. Yes, thank you. Okay, so she's dead. Very good. So we we're basically done here, done-ish here. Um, let us make sure you're stable. Yeah, because the S3 is a full heal regardless of your HP bar. Um, and let's see if I can just kill her. No, I can't. She has uh, the defense buff. Oh, maybe I can. Let's try again. Oh, no, I can't. Damn, that's such an irritance. <sighs> There's like, for those of you who don't use uh, Spectre Tenebria, there's almost nothing more irritating than the fact that your S1 will never stop. Uh, your S3 will never stop being um, off cooldown. Um, yeah, there's, there's like no other ability that is off cooldown more than your S3. Then you're, for some reason, like, you know, <laughs> other people, their S3s are never up when you need them, but uh, Tenebrios, they are. Uh, with Tenebria, it always is. Uh, let's put the barrier up so I don't actually lose Lilius here. Uh, of course, it didn't really do very much to him. Uh, let's just heal her because she's going to be taking the brunt of his damage. Uh, and he shouldn't really survive here, so I mean, we should be able to like handle this pretty well. 4k, it's not too bad, and we'll do this. And hopefully he'll die, regardless of who teams up. Yeah, regardless of who teamed up, he died. Uh, so we did fine. Um, not too bad. Despite all the RNG that went against us, we did pretty well there. Um, some poor decision making on the uh, original, the, the top team where I went with, um, but that was, that's my fault entirely, so I, I take ownership of that. Uh, of course, we are in higher, well, we're not like in super higher level guilds, but uh, interestingly enough, we're in decently high level guilds. Um, okay, so he's going to S3 someone. Let's, let's put you here. Who has a who has a cleanse? Who do I run that has a cleanse? Hmm. What else do I put here? I kind of like this team, um, but I think Ruel might be better suited up there. Hopefully, she can do what uh, needs to be done to like you know keep us all alive up there. So down here, I think it's a simple matter of maybe running, um, taking CC for one. Where is uh, where is he? So this team would be a great team for ML Crow, which is going to be cool. Um, where's my light guy? Here he is. Let's put you there. And you. Let's, hopefully you're tanky enough to, de to, to deal with all this crap. AoE, uh, S1, and then AoEs, so hopefully I can just kill them all. Hmm, what about you? Or maybe you? You, you? Would you be tanky enough? Uh, yeah, neither of these would be tanky enough to sustain like all the damage that's coming out of this, so... Let's just go in there, see how, uh, how tanky my Charles is these days. Okay. 
It was actually a pretty fast team. That Charles is pretty fast. Uh, my Lilius is like 2.15 or something like that. So fast, tanky. Presumably that means it doesn't do much damage. Eh, it was decent. Let's do this. Get these uh, skill nullifiers off of everybody. I'm gonna trigger Charles as a two, uh, or I guess not. Uh, we will sleep you because why not? Hopefully you don't have a lot of resistance too. Okay. So let's just hit anybody, really. Um, I'm hitting him. Oh, there we go. I'm hitting him because any and all damage, like we're not doing a lot of damage, right? But any and all damage onto him will be the highest it'll be. We really need to crack his passive anyway. Uh, and of course that did a lot of damage. Um, let's just get the shield up. And he's going to S1 anyway, but that's fine. Oh, actually, you know what I should have done there? Uh, is gotten lucky because now I'm screwed. Um, the problem being that uh, he, he's now going to kill my... Um, yeah, the problem is now he's going to... Well, I need to make sure I don't trigger his passive. And of course, he, wow, he just barely did not kill. Of course, I didn't get the team up I needed. Um, so Charles and what's her name is going next. That, this, uh, FCC is actually taking quite a bit of damage. And of course I got uh, provoked. Um, so yeah, I think this is like, this is more an issue of like how much gear they have. Cause this is a lot of gear I'm fighting against. It's like a, it's an uphill battle, like to say the least, you know, that's a, like I said, that's putting it lightly. Um, so we're about to get cleaved, and I think that's it. So I think we just lost. Yeah, so we got this. He's going to cleave us. Uh, and we there's not much we can do anymore. Because um, he's going to hit us. Get the S2, of course. I called it. Uh, even though we're not buffed. And then we're dead. So that's fine. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, gear's a hell of a drug, man. It, uh, not much you can do about it. Uh, of course. Uh, it doesn't really matter because we're all stunned anyway. And then we're going to take this to the face. Um, so don't have to wait a whole other turn. He's probably got Abyssal Crown. Oh, he does because he stunned us the first time. This doesn't do very much because we're all blind and attack broken. Um, Charles is going crazy, but he doesn't have any. He can't do anything. Uh, of course, he can't do anything. So I just like hit this guy. Why not? Uh, we're gonna get outsped by the uh, what's his name there. The Tywin and apparently the oh we did not get outsped by the um <laughs> by the Vildred. This is kind of interesting actually to me um, how how heavily outgeared not only me but my entire team is go is being right now. Um, yeah, I mean I'm not like. I am kind of salty, of course. I mean, anybody would be salty in my position and our position that we're not in here. But I find it more fascinating that we're fighting against such a like gear-intensive guild at at such a low level. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me, but that's neither here nor there, really. Uh, and of course, so the Basar was fast enough to lap us, and on top of the fact that we all had uh, slows on, uh, so that this could happen. Um, so, you know, it is what it is. Not much to be done about it. Of course, he didn't even die from that. And then, you know, here comes him with his S3. Uh, let's see. And then he's going to S1 us here. I, I should probably, you know, I should have probably left there. But, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm excessively salty right now. So I'm just kind of like, I don't care enough. 
Um, but yeah, so th that's kind of interesting. Um, like we've had easier fights up at like top 50 or something like that. Not only in this guild, but like in my previous guild. So something happened with these guys, uh, 160. They like stopped and then they suddenly decided to like recruit a bunch of uh, really strong players or something. And then they just decided to stomp on everybody on the way up again. Um, so that's kind of funny. Um, so we're fighting against basically a bunch of uh, other people with like a bunch of B units. Let's go with you. And uh, let's see what else, who else is here? So we're not gonna be able to sustain the, uh, the, the damage they're putting out on this team here, uh, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, I don't actually know why I'm going with her there. Uh, that's kind of stupid, but there we go. That's better. Uh, let's go with something, I guess, kind of tanky. Let's go with you. I mean, it looks, this, this whole team up here on the top looks kind of dumb, but uh, that's fine. I'll go with you and you, and we'll go with, uh, where are you? Where's my healing lady? Okay, so let's hope uh, Momo can heal through this. So this top team is obviously kind of asinine, but that's fine. Uh, like I said, <laughs> we've sort of given up hope at this point. Um, yeah, so this this lady here is quite fast. Uh, of course, he gets uh, stunned because like he doesn't have any uh, any what's it called there. Let's just hit him with this one. It's not that big a deal. Okay, that did nothing to no one, obviously. Ooh, very nice. Okay, so she's going to max heal the Tenebria, which is alright. Oh no, she's actually going to max heal the, um, what's his name? So that's pretty cool. He's doing minimum damage now. And he's hitting the right person, cool. <laughs> uh, what's his name? Uh, G-Perk doesn't even have to be conscious for any of this. He just has to get, like, the snot beaten out of him for no real reason. <laughs> Uh, I love that. Uh, so let's do this. Okay, so I got the stun. I forgot that I have him on a on a, have her on abyssal now. That's pretty cool. So there you go. We basically uh, did doing pretty well here. Um, <laughs> he gets the S three again, but on the same target. So that's pretty cool. Sepulchrum only one stack. Don't kill him. He died. Okay. Well, that kind of sucks. Let's see if I can strip that. No, I could not. Couldn't even stun him. Uh, come on. Remove the immortality. Stun him. Do something, please. Oh my gosh. Like, having this fast Vildred is so great. Uh, so that my Vildred gets to revive and kill everybody. Uh, now he gets the greater attack buff. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's golden. Oh man, I gotta use Vildred in more stuff. Uh, I just like, he, it's scared to, you kinda get scared to use him because like, for one he dies immediately, like someone sneezes at him, but we just got kinda lucky that uh, all the attacks went on to G-Perg there. And everybody else got ignored for some reason. So I mean like the initial, what's her name? The initial attack from the... Uh, So I have to do something kind of sneaky here. I need to make sure that uh, Cesarado has the lowest HP compared to um, compared to uh, him. Uh, let us hit someone that's gonna be worth something. So we'll hit you for now, uh, and then you know my uh, Momo can follow up afterwards. With her heals. So that did decent damage, so I'm pretty happy about that. Okay, so my Crow is now healthier than my Cesarado, which is the it's a good thing because it means that now uh, MLCC will attack the Cesarado. Um, as long as this doesn't drop. Nope, she's gonna hit her, yep. And she has enough to uh, do that, so that's fine. Okay, now he's lower by a. Huge margin, actually. Um, 
let's uh, push uh, somebody back here. We'll put you. We'll push you back. Your defense broken. Unfortunately, my Momo is a uh, does not have enough. Apparently, does not have enough effect resistance. <laughs> A Momo of all creatures does not have enough effect resistance. The absurdity of it uh, is not lost on me, trust me. Yes, that's exactly what I want. All right, cool. Perfect. Uh, actually, though, that's this isn't good here. Um, well, actually, I don't want to do that either. Oh, okay, cool. She survived. So everything's going decent. Not as uh, nice as maybe uh, you would want it to, but uh, it's not going decently well, so please die. Yep, she's dead. And he got the counter, so that's fine. But again, this is our last one, so we're good to go. If he dies, it's okay. But she didn't even die, so that's cool. Let's heal up here. Okay. Oh, I guess the saving grace is that uh, he has a chance to hit us with the S1. Um, <clears throat> which will give us the attack break on the uh, Cesarado. Uh, let's just max heal everybody just for the sake of it. Oh, actually, I probably should have waited because, um, Krau's S3 was up in a little bit, but okay, that's fine. Um, he'll be focusing on him anyway. Let's just hit you. I wonder if he's on counter set. Let's find out. I'll show you my power. Okay, so that went pretty well. Um... Funnily enough, for those of you who don't know, uh, Cesarado is a pretty good counter to the uh, ML Surin. Uh, so, you know, <clears throat> I would recommend busting him out uh, for that. Uh, unfortunately, you know, she's so prevalent in the meta, it just means your your, your Cesarado is even more valuable than, than you might have thought. Um, but yeah, so we learned a few things today. I mean, I got to bring, for one, I got to bring Dizzy and, and, um, <laughs> and, uh, Arbor Vildred into more stuff and not be so reserved with them. Um, I for I also forgot that my Dizzy was on Abyssal Crown, so she could not have removed the Immortality, which I kept waiting for her to do. Um, so that was another interesting thing. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, for one, I got to get a better Dizzy. I still like her on counter, um, but my counter gear on her is actually pretty bad. Um, but yeah, everything else. Uh, did pretty well other than like the fact that my uh, Ruel eats all the damage for free all the time. She's not tanky enough um, But that's something I have to kind of go in there and fix and see what I can do about uh, But yeah, other than that uh, Not too bad uh, We got kind of stomped on but that's just because the whole team is getting stomped on so but if people better than people if people who are better than me are getting stomped on um, I'm pretty happy to have done all right uh, at the end of the day uh, but yeah, so that was that was today's Guild War. Um, hopefully, something was gleaned from this, um, other than just be careful <laughs> who the game matches you against, because some pretty weird power differentials there. Uh, but yeah, so that was that.